Trey, you got in the starting lineup. I guess that was a pretty good move for you tonight, huh? Uh, I just deal with, with the best with the team. You've always said all along you don't mind coming off the bench if that's what it takes. But uh, if this kind of performance, what you can uh, look forward to when you're starting, do you hope you're back in the lineup uh, starting again? Man, it's whatever the team wants. I mean, I don't mind starting. I don't mind coming off the bench as long as we get the dub. So. You had the stroke going tonight. How satisfying was it to throw in that final three pointer? Oh, very satisfying because uh, we came out there with the edge on our shoulder last game, and that was a statement shot. So to me, it was it was a statement shot. So I just felt like it was necessary, so, and we had to shoot it, otherwise it might be a turnover. Trey, it looked like it was early in the second half after one of your buckets. You're going back down. Look at you sitting on back, mouth on back. Was that uh, was that kind of meaning behind that? Uh, I felt I felt. Uh, confident again. I feel like myself again, so I just stayed with it. Trey, I see you uh, light up big smile every time you land three. Uh, what's uh, kind of the significance of that to you? When you practice that a lot, right? Because uh, I know how hard I work. I'm not even shot so I get a day, so it's, it's very disappointing. And, um, I'm shooting so much and I'm missing the way I was. And so for tonight to finally hit those shots, I worked so hard on it. Just, it just felt good, so hard not to smile. How about we'll that? Talk about uh, how big this win is over UNCG twice this year. I mean, this is huge as far as the uh, Southern Conference Championship is concerned. I mean, this is it's a big win. Like every win is a big win. You know, trying to go to the tournament, got a first seed. You know, get to the tournament. But this one, in particular, this is a big win. They're one of the top teams in our league. So coming in here, I mean, they hit us in the mouth early, 15. I mean, 5 to 19 to start off, and I mean, I was proud of us, you know, we didn't lay down a year ago, we probably would have just let them keep running it up, but we came back, hit them back in the mouth, and came back. What's that like to see that score stuck on five, and see Miller hitting everything in the world, throwing up, jump, right, left, everything's going on? I mean, to be honest, I, we really don't, I, honestly, people are going to hit shots, it's just, well, we can control what we do, so, I mean, we was all together, came back and fall back, so. Lucas, can you talk about inside? I mean, Dickey, obviously, uh, the guy that's returning from last year's team, uh, first team all-conference. Uh, you kind of take that personally, I mean, when you play against a guy like that? Uh, yeah, of course, we compete uh, in the thing down there. Uh, yeah, I was trying to get stops on the team, just going on trying to get in foul trouble. Oh, you agreed just a second ago. You said, yeah, he's back. What did, what did you see in him to train? I mean, like, like he said, I see night in, night out, the work he put in. I mean, sometimes I even go with him. I mean, the shots he shoot every night, every day, he puts in the work. I mean, like he said, for him to miss those, it's disappointing. Like, when he was missing, I was telling him every day, every pass I tell him, I tell him keep shooting. Keep shooting, it's going to come. I mean, the first time I passed to him, he shot it over the side and go. I told him, keep shooting. I mean, 30, 30 tonight. So, I mean, I mean I'm mean, i proud of him. I mean, shots went in, he's happy, I'm happy, the team happy, so. Trey, the fans were happy too, and you were, uh, one one time there, you were running down the sideline, slapping hands with him. What was that all about? Man, it was just like, the fans gave great energy, so I wanted to give it back. And I knew it was a timeout, so I tried to run over there real quick, and just get them pumped, and get them excited to make them feel like they are part of the game too. And I just watched the game, so just some quick idea. He had 6,000 the last game, 53 or something here tonight. How, how nice is that to get the crowd like that and get them going? It's good, it's good for them to come every night because some schools in the country don't even get a thousand to the game. So we're very grateful of that. And we just wish everybody to come, keep coming. So keep coming. So just how satisfying is to get that bad taste out of your mouth? With a win like this after a loss to Mercer. Yeah, that's great, man. Uh, it's never fun to lose. Uh, we got a quick turnaround, you know, it's got to be the next game. And then uh, we got to be all done tonight. So.